Now the problem is, how do you take it? Well, stomach acid breaks down BPC-157. It breaks down peptides in general. And his first statement is, is that BPC is broken down in the gastric juice. Does he realize that BPC, pentadecapeptide, is made from human gastric juice? So the bioavailability, meaning the amount that is available to be utilized by the body after you take it orally is about 10 to 20% of the dose taken. Now this is appropriate in some conditions, you know, because obviously peptides, proteins, nature into certain environments. We know this. pH is one of those things. So gastric juice has a very low pH and of course could break down and limit the bioavailability of most peptides. This is a true statement. So there's no evidence that you can take enough to have any meaningful effect in your body to be helpful. So many people turn to injecting it. Well, the half-life of injectable BPC-157 is one to two hours. So would you inject it into your foot every one to two hours for some unknown benefit? I wouldn't. First of all, we need to know what the benefit is, right? Why are we taking this? Ultimately, uh, no, it's not destroyed by the gut. It is one of the only peptides that isn't because it has actually created by or is created from human gastric juices. So this gentleman is definitely getting in the way of his own rhetoric. BPC is helpful for injury prevention and solution. So keep that in mind and can be also taken orally.